Foster's Game Reviews. So. <laughs> <laughs> Thoughts and views on the Nintendo Switch as it stands now. What? <laughs> what are you laughing at? <laughs> Just stop the video. Why? Okay. Thoughts and views on the Nintendo Switch as it stands as we speak because I think it's going the same way as the Wii U. I went into game the other week and there's a new game uh, called I forget the entirety of the game, the title, and it's something to do with the troll. It's um, something something troll and it's coming out on the Xbox One and it's coming out on the PS4 the promotional wall was there for both titles yes I repeat both titles but it is also getting released on the Switch where was it? it was absent like many other titles on the Nintendo Switch very very absent in recent months weeks so it's only been out for a short while, but I have noticed they are treating it exactly the same as what they did with the Wii U. It's getting very neglected. The releases a week. I have a big. I'm very a big. I'm very passionate about Nintendo. I do like them. I like uh, many other companies as well, along with Sony. Might I say, only on the PS One. Although, did I, although I did acquire a PS3, which I'm still working on to get working properly. But, we're not talking about that, we're talking about the Nintendo Switch. The, um, let me show you my t-shirt off. We're, show, we're talking about the lineup of games. Um, you go into a store and the games are literally exactly the same as they were when it came out on release. There's been nothing new, it's not grabbing the audience. In fact, in my opinion, it's shoving them away. They're looking at it and think, is that it? Right, I'll go for a PS4 or I'll go for an Xbox One. A lot of the titles are coming out for it, are download. Uh, there's very few and far between in the eShop. <coughs> I didn't want to say this, I didn't want to do this video, but it's just my views and opinions. That's just how I feel. I have three games and I haven't, I've got no interest in any of the others so far. Yeah, I know there's one. You have some upstairs in the. No, box. for the Switch. For the Nintendo Switch. Oh, yeah. Is the new that one. Zelda? Yes, um, yes, go on. Bomboy. Bomboy. Bomberman, close Bomber enough. Man. Yeah, Bomberman. And? We both played it. Um, one, two. Switch. Yes. So, switch. onto a Switch. Yeah. They're the three titles I had, and they're the three titles I still have. Apart from Mario Kart 8, which I have yet to pick up, it's yeah, basically because... just a rehash of the Mario Kart 8 that came out on the Wii U. Yes. So it's no different, really. No. No. So... But it's, hmm? but it's a deluxe. Oh, the deluxe. Yes, it yeah. is the deluxe version, because it has uh, several more characters, new tracks, but we had that. New cat. Uh, new carts, new new everything, mm -hmm. but we had that on the Wii U, unfortunately, on the download pack, which I bought, and there isn't much mm, really new in the line of content on this new one. I could be wrong, uh, and I do believe there's only a one unlockable character, so I've heard. Don't know how true it is, but that's not a great amount of characters to unlock. Yes, one car. Probably a gold car. Mm. But I'm finding it a little bit lacklustre. Uh, there are several titles that need to come out over here. Binding of Isaac, Isaac, not Isaac, Binding of Isaac, and the other one is um, Has Been Heroes, uh, Puyo Puyo Tetris, which uh, Jordi uh, seems to be an avid fan of. I, I, I've, I've played the demo. 
and uh, I'm struggling with the demo. So Jordi, if you can uh, teach me, then please do. <laughs> drop me a drop me some uh, tips below. Um, but now, I just I don't know if you agree with me or disagree. So please feel free to comment below, and we'll uh, continue this debate in a further video. So. On that note, I've had my little rant, so uh, keep gaming with the turtle. Yeah. I can't press the button to stop the video. Yeah. <laughs> and don't forget to like and subscribe, and also follow us on Instagram. Hello, Matt Foster's of Seven.